it's 6 30 a.m and i look like this time to get starbucks change it around i was feeling like <laughs> that's what we do instead of school <laughs> Did you see the, the promo photos for TXT's comeback? Yeah. <gasps> they all look so good. Huh? Huh? We're not talking about the moment. Who was Taeyang? I'm assuming that's how you say his name because it's not Taeyang, it's Y A N G. Let's it's just say like Ang instead of Ong. It's like Taeyang. Mm -hmm. yeah. Make her do an introduction like you made me do it. Oh my god, can I? Yeah. Hi, I'm None? Sarah. I am responsible for all of AS K pop videos. I am a drunken connoisseur. <laughs> Can you, can you take that out? That's embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. I'm not gonna lie, because there's a whole thing about Anna, and you're just like, yeah, Sarah and Aaron, I haven't seen that. So <laughs> <laughs> it's like, okay. Do not talk about my Lord and Savior. I think that's you. He falls in love. Mm -hmm. yeah, <laughs> you also Google Fire. No. Gulp. <laughs> <laughs> not lying. Time for class. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ada, and if you are not new here, welcome back. So it is officially winter semester. Today was my first day of classes. It is Tuesday, January 10th. I've been up since 4.30, as you all saw, and I got home around 4.30. So I was gone for 12 hours, basically. I'm exhausted. I'm tired. I still look really good though. Like, the, the mug is serving. My hair not so much, like my curls sort of fell out, but whatever it was kind of expected this is going to be a first week of school vlog there is so much going on this week like i work tomorrow but i have classes thursday and friday thursday is gonna be a long day i have to be at school until like 7 p.m i have school issues that i need to figure out like course wise program wise just stuff needs to be figured out and my advisors need to answer their emails because i need to figure this stuff out and i need to stop stressing about it i'm exhausted i need to take my makeup off even though it still looks good i need to shower i need to edit a video luckily i don't have any homework yet but um yeah i have a funny story to tell you all but i was gonna wait until i took off my makeup and got settled down for the evening but i decided i wanted to tell you now anna and i went to my poli sci class and I had never been in this building before, neither had Anna. We'd been in the building, but we never had a class in the building. We find my room. First off, all the tables are circular tables, which means you have to sit facing people. The prof could not face everyone at the same time. It was just a really weird layout. And second off, every table had a microphone in the table for each person. I realized that the microphones were four pretty quickly. My poli sci class has an hour long discussion every week and the microphones are so when someone wants to talk, they can turn on the microphone. I sat down. And Anna sat down and we looked at each other and we were like, what is going on? And Anna looked at me and went, do you, you want to stay here? And I said, no, I think I'm going to drop the course. And so we got up and left after maybe sitting down for not even a minute. That's how I decided to drop my poli course. This was after I found out that I didn't really need the course, but I was like, what am I going to replace it with? Because I'm only in school part time. I don't want to ruin the schedule because I already submitted my availability at work. It's just a mess. It's a mess right now. I am sort of stressing out. I'm just gonna drink my tea out of my UGH mug and um, try to pretend that everything's okay. Good afternoon. It is currently 4 p.m. I just finished work. I literally just got in my car. I'm exhausted. I didn't have school today, but I think I was still tired from yesterday. Like I should have went to bed earlier, but anyways, I'm just about to go see my grandparents because they have a little surprise for me and my family went and saw the surprise without me because I was at work. So I'm now going to visit them and see what it is by myself and then tonight is just gonna be a chill night because tomorrow is gonna be a very long day I have work bright and early at 5 a.m. and then I have to go home get ready for school because I have a class at 2 30 and then I'm on campus all day until like 8 p.m. because I have a meeting between 5 and 7 with like counselors advisors that's what they're called obviously I have to get my matcha guys don't tell anyone this but I think I'm starting to get sick of my matcha. Like, it's just not tasting the same. I think I need to take a break. And literally, like, my coworkers bully me for it. Like, I came in this morning and ordered it, and the person that took my order was like, oh, wow. Typical.
it's almost 10 p.m. and I am exhausted and I have such an early morning tomorrow. I have to get up at like 4 a.m. because I have work at 5 but I pushed myself and I persevered and I finished editing this video. It took me about three, three and a half hours, but I just want to get it uploaded and get it ready for tomorrow. And I don't have to worry about it anymore. I'm exhausted. I will probably have a really good sleep, but just want to do a little check-in before I go to bed and um, tell you all that I persevered and I pushed through and I hope y'all are proud of me. Good afternoon. It is almost 4 p.m. I worked this morning and then I went back home and I like got ready and I left for school around 1-ish. I had a class at 2.30, which was good. It was a little weird. It was a little chaotic because I missed my first bus. So then I got off the bus at like 2.22. Class was started at 2.30. It was a big class, the full class. I tried to sit in a seat. And this guy looks over at me and is like, oh, sorry, we're saving those seats. It was like three seats. I'm like, mm, there should be a maximum amount of savable seats. I wandered campus for a good 20 minutes trying to find an empty classroom because I was feeling a little overstimulated. I was like, I don't want to be around people. I have an important meeting to attend at 5, which is why I'm still here. It's from 5 to 7. I'm hoping I'm not here until 7 p.m. Let's do an OOTD. I, I kind of am, am digging the fit today. It's really simple, but this is the fit. Tricky feelers. I am Gia jeans. They're low rise and they don't fit me. They're too big, so I have to wear them with baggy clothes. This shirt, I love this shirt. It's a Capcom Resident Evil 4 shirt. It has Leon on the back and it says something like I don't remember. It's from Omnia, which is a thrift store, a local thrift store. This turtleneck is from Princess Polly. Bow is from Amazon. Genetics from our Lord and Savior. I'm just gonna touch on my makeup before I go to this meeting. These are the Tatcha. Japanese beauty papers. I got these a few weeks ago. I did a haul of them in like the last vlog I did, but I don't carry makeup around with me. So I thought these would be good to have in my purse. They're like small, compact. And I guess we'll just blot away my oil because I get pretty oily throughout the day, especially because I'm not touching up. I don't bring my powder or anything with me. These are like $20, $16. And they come with 40 sheets. You can use the front and the back. So kind of like 80 sheets. I made it home safely. It is almost 8 p.m. I've been up since 3.45. I got home like 20 minutes ago. I had to stop and get Starbucks. The workers were like, you look delirious. And I'm like, yeah. Like my eyes are bloodshot. You can't really tell on camera, but I'm delirious. I'm exhausted. Uh, I'm gonna take my makeup off and go to bed. I'll see you tomorrow. Good afternoon. It is 2 p.m. I worked this morning. I technically have a class in half an hour, but does it look like I'm going? I'm actually having early dinner with some of my ex coworkers at 4 p.m., but I just got up. I just want to come up on and try out McDonald's new spicy chicken nuggets with y'all. This might not be a new thing in like the States, but here in Canada, this is new. This is what the nuggets look like. They're a little bit red. They have a little bit of a reddish tint. Nugget taste test. That's good. Spicy, yes. Why say it's super spicy? No. It has like a kick to it, which I actually like really like. Let's try it with the ranch sauce. Mmm. Oh my God, that's everything. I give them like a eight out of 10. Not as good as a regular chicken nugget. Thank you, who, whoever is up above, for bringing ranch sauce to McDonald's Canada. Okay, I just got home, and I'm gonna go to bed very soon. It's almost 9 p.m., but I am just gonna write in this card. I got this cute little friendship card 
because one of my favorite co-workers is leaving she's transferring to another store which i'm very sad about so i just got her a card and i got her this little gift card i'm just gonna write in this because i'm gonna go bright and early tomorrow because she works early in the morning and i'm gonna see her and give her her present but i'm gonna write a like, cute little message in here How cute this card is. Oh my god. And I wrote like a huge long message. That's all you're getting. That's the glimpse you're getting. With that being said, this vlog is coming to an end. I had an okay first week. I think like some days I wasn't on campus at all, obviously because I don't classes. And then some days I was on campus like all day. Like Thursday almost killed me. Thursday almost took me out, waking up at 3.30 for work and then getting home around like 7.30 almost killed me i hope you all enjoyed this first week vlog if you did please make sure to like and subscribe down below all my social medias are always in the description instagram tiktok twitter it would mean so much to me if you followed me over on those that is all for today i hope you enjoyed and i will see you in the next one thanks for watching bye